It's with uh, Russell Fabus, a uh, bail bondsman from Miami who's been in the business for a very long time. Thank you for being here with us, Russell. Russell, uh, we want to ask you uh, a question, you know, based on your experience and your time about what it takes to be a successful bail bonding agent. Well, actually what it takes to be a successful bail bond agent is one thing only. It's called your word. Because in life, the only thing that you can give to anybody is your word. And if you treat people with respect and they have your word, this is how an agent could build a business and a reputation. And it's basically, there is nothing more, nothing less in life than uh, for an agent, if he's doing a bond, whatever he says, to be there, to be available. This is a service-oriented business. You have to be available 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and you just basically got to do the right thing. And I've found that uh, I have a large agent force, and the agents that are the most successful ones are the people that are, that whatever they say, they do. And that's how you build your business. And Russell, uh, some of the characteristics of bad agents, you know, over time in your experience, what was it that they presented? Well, what really creates bad agents, and sometimes people like time, they change. Uh, if drugs or alcohol get involved, uh, you could have an agent that could be an excellent agent for many, many years, and something comes into his life where he changes, uh, maybe through divorce, stress, pressure, gets involved, uh, drugs and alcohol. I find that to be the number one problem with agents as far as uh, being a lost agent. Normally, <clears throat> agents, if you got a good agent, uh, he'll remain a good agent indefinitely unless something comes into his life to interrupt and change his way of life. Thank you, Russell. Have a good day.